My name is Amy Quinn. I am 20 years old and I was diagnosed with ovarian cancer when I was 19. I remember it sort of started with extreme tiredness, like nothing like you've ever been before. I also had a really persistent pain in my side, which was really uncomfortable all the time. I probably went to the GP about five, six times before I was sent for my scan. When I had the scan, sure enough, like the doctor said, there was a small cyst in my left ovary but I didn't think that was all that was causing the problems because it was something so insignificant and uh, I was given a talk by a teenage cancer trust at my school and I remember them saying that you had to be really persistent. When I had the operation I asked the surgeon if he could have you know, a little bit of a look around. I conveyed my worry to him. Um, inside he found some other stuff and then I went to meet the doctor and at this point I'd already said to my dad, look I think I actually have cancer and he thought it was insane and I was over exaggerating, but that is what it was. Once he said it, I didn't really listen to any of the rest of the conversation, to be honest. To other young people, I would say that they also have to be as persistent as I was, even though it's probably nothing. It's better to be checked out and be safe than sorry.